Greetings, YouTube. The doctor is in. Dr. Urios Papers here coming at you with another commentary on Dungeons and Dragons. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you like this video, hit the like button. And if you have any questions or comments, please leave a question or comment. All right, today it's time for another installment of the Doctor Spell Prognosis. And today we are talking about the spell Hellish Rebuke, a first level spell. I am giving this a B minus uh, for a few reasons. One, um, it's only usable by Warlocks and Orth Oathbreaker Paladins, which isn't necessarily a PC Paladin. Um, if this is on an NPC that I am throwing at a party, then this is actually a pretty good spell. Uh, but if it is on a PC, I, I, I have a hard time, especially with a Warlock and the limited number of slots that they have, uh, you know, per hour, of course, um, I have a I have a hard time justifying this spell being one of those. So, um, uh, it is a reaction. I get that, but I, there I think there are other spells that are more worthwhile. Hex being one of them, and we'll talk about that. Uh, so it's a first level spell. It is a reaction spell. Uh, which you take in response to being damaged by a creature within 60 feet of you. So if something damages you within 60 feet, so ranged attack, melee attack, whatever, it doesn't matter. You, that you can pop this off. Uh, range 60 feet, obviously, verbal and semantic. Uh, it's an evocation, instantaneous duration. It's a deck save, which which is, that's it's not the best of the saving throws, but it's the best one of the physical saving throws that you want. It does fire damage. That's not the best damage. Um, there's a lot that is resistant to fire. So you point your finger, and the creature that damaged you, so they have to hit and they have to do damage, is momentarily surrounded by hellish flames. The creature must make a dexterity saving throw. It takes 2d10 damage on a failed save or half as much on a successful one. And, uh, you know, you can upcast this. 1d10 for each slot above first. The only problem with that is if you are a warlock, you need to pay attention to this because you can only get up to fifth level spells. So that, but in, keep in mind, that does mean that this will do 7d10 fire damage to something that hit you if you cast it as a fifth level spell, but you're giving up one of your slots, one of your packed magic slots. So it's okay. Uh, it's a good damage. That's why I'm giving it a B minus. It's a deck save. So that means it doesn't get less than a B minus because it's the better of the three physical saves. But it is fire damage. Um, and it is to against one creature. And it, you know, I not much more I got to say about this. That's about it. So all right. I appreciate everybody tuning in and I will catch everybody later.